archaeologists uncover exceptional ancient mural near Colosseum. In ancient Rome, the Latin word luxuria represented lavish displays of wealth and power in physical forms like clothing, buildings, and banquets. Some decried luxuria as a foreign influence, antithetical to Rome itself, even as Roman leaders like Marcellus and Mark Antony embraced it. A team with Rome's Colosseum Archaeological Park has uncovered a pristine mural, crafted of shells, stones, minerals, and imported tiles, that serves as an example of luxuria from more than 2,000 years ago. The mural was found in the remains of a Roman house known as a domus near the Colosseum. This discovery is exceptional for a simple reason. There is nothing else like it from this period in Rome. Massimo Ozana, Director General of Museums at the Italian Culture Ministry, tells James Imam of the London Times. The mural dates to between the 1st and 2nd century BCE. Its intricate designs show weapons and instruments hanging alongside ships and tridents. Archaeologists think a wealthy Roman officer commissioned it after a military success. Osana tells the Times that many clues in the mural could help researchers determine who owned this home. Whoever the owner was, he may not have stayed wealthy for long. Evidence suggests that his family fell out of favor when the Roman Emperor Augustus came to power. The building and its contents were later buried and replaced with a grain store built directly on top of it. The owner may have been on the wrong side of politics, Osana tells the Times. The area of the discovery, situated on the Palatine Hill, was home to generations of influential Romans. Earlier this month, the nearby Domus Tiberiana opened to visitors following 50 years of renovations. The palace was built by the Emperor Tiberius and was much beloved by his infamous successor, Nero. The Palatine Hill has always been the stage of Rome's power politics. Giorgio Franchetti, an archaeologist and historian of ancient Rome, tells CNN's Silvia Marchetti. The principle of luxuria demonstrated in the mural is evident from its sheer grandeur as well as from small details such as individual Egyptian tiles. Colored glass, marble, and a special volcanic stone called Podzolana pull the artwork together. The space around the mural is called a specus estivus, which is a vaulted, cave-like room around the home's atrium that's used as a banquet hall or entertainment space, according to Rhea Naya of Hyperallergic. Lead pipes in the walls fed into various water features within the room. The archaeological excavation will conclude in the first months of 2024, says Alfonsina Russo, director of the Colosseum Archaeological Park, in a statement per Google Translate. We will subsequently work intensely to make this place, among the most evocative of ancient Rome, accessible to the public as soon as possible.